Thank you for joining us at the Palette Fine Wine video blog. My name is Stuart Langer and I'm your host. Guys, I'm going to talk to you about one of the most interesting wines uh, we've ever had in the store. Uh, it's really a pretty amazing story. Uh, this is Kaylin Sellers. This is their 1994 Chardonnay. Um, it's from the Livermore Valley. It's their QVW. Wait a second. Did you hear me? It's a 1994 Chardonnay, all right? And it is incredible, incredible wine. It's $39.99 and it is Fabulous. So let's talk a little bit about what they're doing there. Um, we don't talk about uh, aging Chardonnays very much. We In America, we get in too big a hurry, I think, a lot of times to drink our wine. Um, so what Kalen does, uh, instead of releasing their wines when they bottle them, which this wine was bottled in 1995, 1995, that's 15 years ago, okay, this wine was bottled. All right. So instead of releasing the wine right away in, you know, 96, 97, he holds it in his cellar waits till the wine matures, and then release it when the wine is ready. The, the grapes are 60-plus-year-old vines, okay, that this has grown on, or now they're probably 75 years old, right? Um, so 60-plus-year-old vines that the grapes are grown on, okay? Um, and uh, it gives this wine just an unbelievable quality. We, um, in Burgundy, you can age wines 30, 40 years. But in America, we don't think about aging wines until they're mature, until they're ready to drink. In this case, he's done it for us. So uh, the wine advocate, Robert Parker, rated this wine a 94. Um, he says that Kalen um, is one of the best Chardonnay producers and probably the best Sauvignon Blanc producer in America. Okay, um, I've got about three cases of this wine. It's not going to last. It's going to disappear very quickly. I also was able to get a case of their 1997 Sauvignon Blanc that he just released that is mind-blowing. It's an incredible, incredible wine. There were two cases that came to Missouri. I got one of them. Uh, and that Sauvignon Blanc is about $35. If you want some, you better contact me because it's an amazing little wine. So first off, we take a, take a smell of it. Um, if you haven't had an aged Chardonnay, it's really difficult to kind of describe. Um, creaminess, nuttiness, A little bit of spice just on the back of the holiday spice on the back of the nose. A little hint of caramel. It smells like an aged Chardonnay. Um, it's beautiful, uh, absolutely gorgeous. Something that you you should experience, okay? Um, and then you can kind of understand you know, the difference between this fresh, vibrant, crisp, overly oak Chardonnay that we get now to one that's 10 years old, 15 years old, and how beautiful they can be. And they really open up and just have this amazing texture and style to them. Good acidity, pleasant mouthfeel, long aftertaste. I'm still tasting the wine. Uh, this wine was open last night. Um, it's not quite as good today as it was last night. It's also a 15-year-old wine, so that would make sense. Um, my recommendation would be to drink it on the first day. Of course, that's not usually a problem. Um, beautiful wine, guys. Um, pleasant mouthfeel, creamy, a little holiday spice on the back of the palate. Um, mellow fruit, not this super citrus kind. A little more melon kind of coming out in it. Um, just a pretty outstanding, amazing wine. I can still taste it. Uh, aftertaste will last 30, 40 seconds, uh, maybe 50 seconds. Uh, beautiful wine. Uh, if you get the opportunity to try an H Chardonnay, uh, this would be as good of an example as you would ever find. Uh, spectacular, spectacular wine. Kalen Sellers, 1994 Chardonnay from the Livermore Valley. QVW rated 94 points by the Wine Advocate. It's $39.99. Don't let this opportunity pass you by. How many times do we get to try something that's already been aged for us and it's ready to go? It's mature, it's ready to drink, and the producer is obviously putting his hand stamp on it because he's just now releasing it. This is an incredible, incredible opportunity. If you get the if you get the chance, you definitely want to pick some of this up. So uh, it'll be here at Palette. I just ordered the last of what they had. Uh, hopefully, I'll have about three cases or so, um, and it won't last long. So definitely come by and check this wine out. Um, you will not be disappointed.